Friday and the sun is shining. Yay! You know, I get excited about Fridays. I'm a bit of a weird one. I love Mondays to goal set and get things out there. And then I love Fridays to celebrate and see where I'm at, what goals I kicked, what could be better, what did I exceed. So I love Fridays. And I love even more when the sun is shining. It's so good after all this rain. So I hope all my um, clients that I've been talking to in Queensland, I hope you're all safe and that the rain hasn't hindered your business or you and that you're all okay. Luckily for us, the sun's shining and that puts me in a really good mood. I just want to tell you a little bit about that. Um, this week's been a really big goal setting week for me. I've done a lot of mindset stuff and I've been revisiting a manifesting course and things like that I'm doing. And it's something as a salon owner that is constant all the time. You have to know where your goals are um, and the goalposts that whether you're getting there or you're like way off track because otherwise you just float from month to month. So today's Friday. It's the end of the week. I want you to tick off what goals you've got accomplished for this week, but it's the end of the month as well. So this is a really important time of the year like I've been honing in on in the last few weeks that we've got three months left to smash it, to sort out whatever we need to sort out to smash it to make this year awesome but to set ourselves up for next year so very happy that I'm going to Bondi Junction on Monday with an awesome salon owner who has also realized this is a point of view that she wants to change things around and mix it up and make sure that she can smash it out for the next three months and also turn her business around for next year as well so she's starting the four-week supercharge program so that's so exciting for both of us can't wait to get in there and get down and dirty and and teach her all the stuff that i know and make her life so much easier she's a, a fairly new salon owner so she's ready to absorb everything that i want and and she's she's smart that she's off to a good start now and putting a hand up and saying you know what teach me what you know and i'm good to go like why am i going to struggle around for the next two or three years and find my feet when there's some proven systems and things like that in place. So really excited about that for Monday. Really excited that the month has come to an end and that I did need to pull my head in a little bit as well. The weather depresses me and it's something that shouldn't happen, but it does. Constant rain really, really overshadows me and pulls me down a little bit. So I really did do some heavy work on mindset this month where were you pulling your head in like did you know where your goals were or did you just go all over the place have you already prepped yourself now that next week's school holidays the week after that's easter and anzac day so there is a few weeks of disharmony coming into salon businesses are you prepped are you ready to go for that if not this is the weekend to get your head around that also this is the next three months to work out where you where you're flawed where your strengths and weaknesses are and what you can do to be better to smash the rest of this year out. So, like I said, we've got the four-week supercharge program happening. This is something that I wish I had had as an early newbie on owner. Had I known this, even five years in, I wish I had known this instead of having to stress for 28 years working out the ins and outs. So... If you are serious about wanting to take your salon to the next level, then seriously, you need to look at the four-week supercharge program. It's all about success. It's about teaching you where your strengths and weaknesses are, how to utilize them, how to get the most out of your staff, how to tweak your advertising, how to tweak your packages that you have a consistent form of income. Because I know as a salon owner, generally it's month to month. So if you can actually customize things in your salon that you have a great membership package happening within the salon it, it takes the stress off and you don't have to go on the hunt for new clients all the time old clients are always going to be better they're always trusted to you they believe in you they want to be there that they're they're easier to pump into other stuff but I do have some awesome techniques into changing new as well so this internet is gonna cut in and out so I'm hoping it's not too distorted for you I'm gonna put the link below I want you to celebrate in Fridays like I'm trying to teach you to do. Fridays are awesome. Like It should be like, cool, I've done this, this, and this, and this, or I missed out on this, and this, and this. So that actually gives you something to think about over the weekend. So by Monday, you're pumped and you're ready to reset those goals and be on a mission again. So I'm going to enjoy some of this sunshine, and that actually works wonders for my mood, works wonders for my goal setting, and the the manifesting course that I've been doing this month 
has really helped me align where my goals are again. And it's a constant. When you're in business, it's a constant and it changes all the time. So unless you actually have a visual focus of where you want to go, what you want to do and when and how and why, you're just floating all over the place and not getting anywhere. So goal setting is really important and it's not all woo-woo stuff. My woo-woo stuff actually works and it's really quite exciting. Uh, it was actually really quite exciting today that we actually cleaned out my office and some of my woo-woo stuff on one of my dream boards in my office was to have my own book. So I actually had a picture of one of Michelle Bridges' book with Michelle Bridges on it and had crossed out her name and wrote my name and had my name, my face next to her and things like that. So I did meet her a couple of weeks ago, which is awesome. And I have my book coming out in like the next week or two as well. So I will actually have a book with my name on the front cover. So my woo-woo stuff does work. So I do get excited about it. And that was one that I'd put up a couple of months ago and sort of forgot about. And the girls found it today and it was like, yay, that's so exciting. So I do want you to get your head around goal setting and some of the woo-woo stuff. Because unless you have something exciting to push you or a goal to get you there, it's not going to happen. You're just going to be doing the do on a daily basis and your business will just stagnate as well. So if you want to push your business to the next level, you have to push you to the next level. And that happens by goal setting every week, every month, and now for the next three months. So enjoy this sunshine while it lasts. And I hope everyone's safe in the rain and have an awesome weekend. And we'll chat next week. See ya.